Uh, so Hasbro decides to fuck themselves. <laughs> They didn't learn from the eight billion dollar laws that Gillette had. Why did from no one stop them playing these? Look at them like, you know, fucking one games. person thought about this. I don't care if they do all sorts of monopolies in the world, but the premise behind Miss Monopoly is reprehensible at best. Yeah, and I don't use that term lightly. Miss Monopoly is some of the most sexist shit I have seen. In a very long time, and not because of the name. So don't, don't uh, you listening right now? Don't be like, <gasps> what is he talking about? I don't think we have yours. The like only that, that reason, <laughs> I don't think so either. I think they've all would have left Which is a nice. long time. They would have left after my Captain Marvel bitching. That's when they left. The fact, I don't care if you want to focus on a female Miss Monopoly. See, yeah, that I don't care. There's Seinfeld Monopoly, Game of Thrones. There's all sorts of monopolies. Okay. <clears throat> But the fact that men inherently make less money in this game than women, so you can falsely virtue signal your shit all over the place, is some of the most contentious bullshit I have heard in my life. Guess what? We all know that there's been gender inequalities. That is not a myth. But guess what? It's 2019, and if you look at it, a lot of this stuff has been rectified in a lot of different places for the reasons that people were screaming about Five, ten years ago. Mm-hmm. A little late to the game. On it's this one. very late to the game, but not even in the original Monopoly that had the Monopoly guy in the front was there ever a rule in any of these games where females had made less money, let's say, in no. Monopoly than males. Mm-hmm. So to use it in a game like this is. Well, who the fuck is actually going to. Like, just. Terrible. Your, no, no, please. Mm-hmm. Like if, in, whatever. if a friend that is a female of mine said, "Hey, let's play Miss Monopoly," you're gonna earn less money than me. I'm gonna say, "No, what the like? What, what is this handicap?" Everyone, you're who's gonna buy it? Well, yeah, it's just. Well, I, feel, I, feel, be... I feel they're setting the people that do buy this, and I'll be honest, they're gonna set their gender back. Of course, they mm-hmm. do. You're, if a women women buy this for the point of yeah, we can play this and we can be ahead, you're you're setting yourselves way back. Mm-hmm. See my, my elastic thing. Yeah, yeah. Oh, here's they're, the thing. they're trying to pull it back, and it's going to start flinging back in their faces. I did a paper on this, like, or just like an essay on this in high school last year, and it was talking about the gender gap and yeah. how, like, it is totally in, pro, or I guess, like, just stupid to expect there to be, or expect women to get paid equally as men, right? Like, just like, like straight up, like, easily. The gap yeah. is closing. Like, it's like, if you yeah. look at It's back, substantially growing, yeah. closing. So it's going to yeah. keep closing, but like to you to say like it's like still super unequal is false because, yeah. well, from my understanding, but like it's, just, it's closing. No, no, it is closing. Yeah, exactly. But the thing is, no one's talking about um, the the inequalities of the disproportionate enough amount of males that are picking up our garbage or keeping the lights on or going out when it's winter outside. Not just men, obviously. There's women in there. But there's more men in these that are out there when it's raining and snowing, keeping our power grid going. And all of these like jobs that are, to some people, menial, that are disproportionately male because males have been going into the coal mines and dying in there, getting killed on their job more than females, all sorts of stuff. Since the beginning of time, Mm -hmm. But that doesn't matter because a lot of the discussion from the radical feminists, because I do understand that there has been disparities before. Yeah, that's we're not we're not talking about those. We're talking about the ones that when you bring those things up, it's like, well, that's not what I'm talking about. Oh, so you just want females to be represented in the top tier, highest paying jobs, not the ones where they're laying brick or drywall, or in the sewers, or picking up garbage, or anything like that. So what you're saying is you want preferential treatment at the jobs available for women, even though these ones are readily available for them. Mm-hmm. That's been an ongoing discussion. That's been an, a, a discussion from a lot of people against mm-hmm. females that are calling for equal opportunities for these things. Yeah. But the thing is, they're also calling for equal outcome, which I've mentioned on the show before, is the worst thing you can ever do. Equal opportunity across the board to every single person. I don't care mm-hmm. who you are, where you're from, what you did, as long as you love me. Sorry, I digress. Wow. <laughs> you should have equal opportunity at almost anything. Mm-hmm. Well, equality is like... And I say impossible. almost because I shouldn't have equal opportunity to go perform in the Olympics. Because I'm a lazy sack of shit and those people bust well, their Well, you asses. have the opportunity, but to state that you can just come uh, like right here I and think go they've and got do a, it. I think they've got a vetting process but you, If you wanted to, you could like... 
do if, it. It's if like, I wanted to, yeah. I can go to like that first round mm-hmm. and then fail miserably. Yeah, sure. Exactly. And and if there's and sure that's fine, but it's I don't have the I shouldn't have that opportunity because I'm a lazy sack of shit. But for equality, like everyone wants equality, but like equality is everyone has their own definition of equality. Mm-hmm. So equality can never be reached. But it's like also like uh, if you were to ask a teacher, okay, you want equality? Yeah, they'd say yes. Would you grade all your students the same? No. There you go. There's no equality. It's yeah. done. If you think about it that way, it's impossible. Mm-hmm. And I'll let you talk. I'll finish this off because I had a good comment and it was really witty on my meme page about this. Monopoly took their totally gender equal game. Mm-hmm. And to make a stand and make a stance on gender inequality, they made a game that is totally sexist and unequal in, in, uh, to no, the opposite sure. gender. Yep. That yep. is their answer to gender inequality. They solved it, guys. Yeah. They good job, Hasbro. Well done. Yeah. You stupid fucks. Careful. He's uh, a hero. Notably, women playing Miss Monopoly make more in the game than men, an advantage that flips the idea of the gender pay gap on its head. This is from Marketing Dive. I don't know who the fuck these people are. Do we know how much it is? Like, how much more they make? Properties have been replaced by innovations women have held crucial roles in creating throughout history. From Wi-Fi to shapewear and the game's traditional house house building system has been switched to establishing headquarters for new businesses. To support the launch, Hasbro has invested roughly $20,580 in real-world money, the total amount of fake dollars available to accrue in Miss Monopoly in young female inventors and entrepreneurs. Oh, never mind. Sorry. No, I take that back. I thought it was in the game. Okay, that's that's fine. Yeah, no. um, So... This is yeah. This is the this is the worst possible thing I think that you can teach anybody, because the problem is this: Are you wanting everything? Are are a lot of these people wanting everything to just completely flip? Do they want it to get better, or do they just want other people to suffer yeah. so that they can get ahead of it? Because that's not how that works. And this is where I'm more leaning to the idea that we are two year old children with. 50 year old or with very new age equipment and we have the morality sorry of two year old children where that is we have almost zero comprehension of how to morally navigate ourselves mm-hmm. now in this world and we are less and less capable with shit like this I don't know go Vasily thoughts I just hope no one buys it Number people want to buy it I think, I think women extre- have to be the extremists I think like women extreme feminists will yeah, definitely buy it well then they're actually anti-feminist at that point well yeah that's that's a, that's the Huge thing that people yeah. try and get across. But Which is what Bill Burr touched on that too. And oh, fuck. Dave it's... Chappelle touched on that too. And again, they made fun of it. They made a joke. But it's beyond true. Well, comedy is supposed they're... to be truthful. Exactly. There's supposed to be, there's supposed to be some real stuff to it. Right. I was going to ask you guys actually, um, are we, do we have anything else in this Miss Marvel or Miss Marvel, Miss Monopoly thing? Not really. Uh, I just think it's stupid. And honestly, yeah. like investing money in like young women is a good, they should have just done that. They, like, there you they go. should just... They should make a Miss Monopoly, mm-hmm. roll it out with the regular same rules, game. regular game, introduce and take out the houses and put the inventions on there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but fine. don't make it so men can make it less. <laughs>